Hey, what's up guys? David here from Dignited. Today I want to show you how you can connect your headphones to your Roku Smart TV or streaming player. All right, let's get into it. Roku is obviously a very popular smart TV platform. I own a Roku TCL Smart TV and a Roku Streaming Player Plus as my primary sources of entertainment. One of the things I like to do is connect my Bluetooth headphones to the TV to hear dialogue a lot more clearly or even for private listening so I don't have to disturb the neighbors or housemates, especially at night. Unfortunately, unlike Amazon's Fire TV or Google Android TV, most Roku Smart TVs and low-end streaming players don't support Bluetooth. So so you can just pair your headphones with your Roku TV or streaming player. However, there is a work around this. You can either use a Roku Premium Remote or Roku Mobile app to connect your headphones to a Roku TV. Alright, so let's start with using a Roku Premium Remote with a headphone jack. One of the ways you can connect your Roku TV to your headphones is through one of Roku's Premium Remotes that have a 3.5mm headphone jack. It's called the Roku Voice Remote Pro. But then again, not all Roku devices ship with this remote. Only the high-end Rokus such as the Roku Ultra, Roku Streambar, Roku Streambar Pro or the Roku Smart Soundbar come with it. So if you don't have one of these then you'll have to purchase it separately for about $30 on Amazon, Best Buy, Walmart and so forth. Then of course your headphones must support a headphone jack too. However, keep in mind that nowadays not every headphone supports a 3.5 headphone jack. So if you have a Roku Voice Remote, Remote Pro and you have Bluetooth headphones with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack then find the built-in headphone jack on the side of your Roku remote and then plug in your headphones firmly. A headphone icon will appear on your Roku television screen to indicate private listening is active. When you want to disable private listening unplug your headphones completely from the remote. The audio will automatically return to your TV speakers at the previous volume. The second method is using the Roku mobile app. Another way to connect your headphones to your Roku TV is through the Roku mobile app. No additional cost is needed here since the app is actually free. I mostly use the Roku app as a remote for my Roku TV. I actually did a video on how to set it up as a remote for your TV so you can watch that video first. The link is in the description below or you can also find it up in this video just up here. Once you've installed and set up the Roku mobile app on your smartphone and connected it to your Roku TV, you now simply have to pair your Bluetooth headphones with your phone. To activate private listening on your Roku app, simply open the Roku mobile app and then tap on the remote icon on the Roku mobile app from the navigation bar. Then tap the headphone icon to activate private listening. The bummer is that the Roku app is not available outside of the US, so you may have to use a third-party app store such as apkmirror.com to download it. Alright, this has been how to connect your headphone to your Roku TV. If you find this video helpful, give us a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Otherwise, we'll see you guys in the next one.